Hey, what's up Halo fans? Welcome back to another Halo video. Now, today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys something very incredible. Uh, basically, we're going to be showing you guys uh, this map that's been ported uh, from uh, Battlefront 2. It is called Geonesis, I think, uh, how you pronounce it. And this map looks incredible. Uh, I was just flying through it, you know, using Forge. Uh, they did a fantastic job, or a fan fantastic job, you know, pulling this in. Uh, all credit goes to your beast quick and stevia uh, is that his name uh do apologize for not saying your name correctly but yeah but credit goes to both of them for pulling this um it just feels oh my god it actually feels like i'm playing battlefront 2 uh i mean i never played battlefront 2 back in the day but uh but i know this obviously feels like you know star wars i, I did play star wars some of the star wars games um i guess i don't really have to play battlefront 2 just to get the feeling you know of this, you know, I've seen it in the movies as well. Um, I think it was Empire Strikes Back where where you see Vader coming in here or something. I haven't seen, I haven't seen that movie in a while, but this is pretty huge. Uh, it's, it's a huge map. You can even forge on here as well. Just literally <laughs> spawn anything. Oop, don't know if I can spawn a mongoose in here. Oh man, can you guys imagine playing Infection on here? Holy moly! Wow. You can. Go all the way down. I, I think there's a kill barrier there. I'm not gonna go all the way down. Probably die. But this map is huge. Very huge. Honestly, I know a lot of people are really hyped up for Forge for Infinite. I'm personally am as well. But I feel like the modding, you know, community are not really getting the recognition. Like this is this is incredible. Wow, man. He even got the. Um, Great. From the movies. And here you have the Millennium Falcon. You can't fly this. I don't think so. I did try. I did try to. But one day I'm sure uh, someone will uh, modern the, uh, the Millennium Falcon. I'm sure there's another location I'm being to. Where is it? And here you have this location. Oh my god. This looks incredible. Like... You can, um... <laughs> Dude, can you imagine the Machinimus? People would have done here, like... Think about the Machinimus back in 2007. If this was a thing back in 2007, my gosh. That's a hologram. I think this is red base. Showing me a red hologram. And, oh yeah, outside, dude, it's absolutely huge. Um, yeah, and by the way, you can actually drive these vehicles sorry i haven't really got around doing that so you can use the toilet oh sorry my in-game audio is too loud sorry let me tweak that up uh you can actually fly this i don't know what you call this vehicle you can actually fly that oh yeah you can and it has a booster. Has a has a light behind it as well, which is pretty cool. So yeah, this map is absolutely huge. Ah, uh, they really got to bring in mo uh, server mod support, so like you can have a lot of players playing this. Because I feel like you know, if you're gonna play this, something it could be it could get boring after after a while. You can actually uh, drive this, by the way. You guys want to see it? I know, like, we saw this in Infinite, but obviously in Infinite, um, you can't really use it, can't really interact with it. But this one here, oh, you can actually drive this and also shoot, thanks to, thanks to the mod tools. So yeah, all credit goes to Beast Quick and Steve for making this. Uh, they've done an amazing job. Hopefully we see more maps like this. I want to see more crossovers you know i want to see more crossover you know from other games like i know currently you know we're seeing uh other halo games or you know other halo assets are going to other halo games which is you know pretty amazing but i want to see something like this like seeing star wars coming into halo and that's what, my, what me and my brother are trying to do uh we're trying to like uh do like a mini crossover do like a crossover with half you know with half life you know Watching one of the maps over there. Wish the FOV was a bit better on this though. 
which you can see the whole thing. How do we call this? What do you call this vehicle? Oh, this is a AT. Let's call it AT. But this map is huge. Um, if I was to fly around here, yeah, can I not go there? Oh, you can. So you can uh, just spawn in literally anything, like, whether if that's a vehicle, you know, just wherever you want to spawn. Oh yeah, these are the vehicles. So you have the, you have this. You can actually, uh, you can actually drive that. I don't know if that's a flying vehicle actually, hang on. Oh yeah, it is. Look at that. This, this is incredible. Dude, like, I'm seeing all the hype with Inf Infinite's Forge. And don't get me wrong, I'm hyped up for Forge in Infinite. You know, I can't wait to make, you know, maps or something. But I feel like modding on the MCC is a whole different level because, because like, with Infinite, the difference is between modding, uh, modding and f modding and, f and Infinite's Forge is you can actually pour over custom vehicles. Or custom weapons and that's something infinite won't really have so like so let's say I, and yeah i understand someone actually ported over the uh uh not ported over someone actually made the uh the vehicle from Star Wars. isn't that vehicle right there uh right over there i know that was it was in uh, infinite's forge but oh my god is that gonna blow but it, it but it's not really interactive you can't really drive it i don't know if like if that's possible in, in infinite's forge we we'll see. I don't know, but but like with the modding, there's there's lots of stuff that you can do that not really Infinite Forge can do. Uh, like you know, porting over custom animation or you know you know custom bipeds. You know, maybe change uh, your Spartan as a Stormtrooper. Uh, there's a lot of like there's a lot of crazy things. You know that. Can, wait, why is that red? Is that alive? Is that is that someone in there? My thing is still on fire. It's not gonna blow, is it? Oh, dude, this this is amazing! Wow, can you imagine if, if we had a lot of players playing on this map? That's one thing MC is missing. I mean, I know we're gonna get Steam Workshop, but if we get if they just manage to give us a uh, server mod spot, I swear to God, dude, there's there's new era for MCC. New era will, will actually begin. But you know, I'm still you know hyped up for Forge. Um, you know, gonna be playing a, uh, a lot around with it. But, but, but I'm sure you guys know what I mean when it comes to like modding, you know. Um, modding is a whole different beast. It's a different animal. You know, like, I challenge anyone. Let me see if you guys can... Obviously, I haven't used Forge. You know, Forge is not even out yet, but... But I swear, I want to see someone... Make, I know there's going to be a map like this. I know there's going to be a lot of... Uh, I know someone can actually almost rep replicate this, I guess, but... When it comes to like vehicles or something, like I want to see, I want to see this and then driving this, this beast, or changing up the uh, player model, playing as a stormtrooper. I mean, I'm not playing as a stormtrooper, but I know it's possible. I've seen someone has done it. Oh, then what the could they easily port? Oh man, I think a beast quick and Steve could have easily ported over the uh, lightsaber. Uh, there's actually a lightsaber mod. If you guys are watching this, a beast quick and Steve. Uh, if you guys get the chance, port over the lightsaber uh, weapon. Because I did, I was playing around with that actually. Ooh, I didn't get to see this. Oh, sugar. Oh, no way. Oh, this is sick, dude. Look at this. I didn't see this. I was exploring around the map for why I didn't get to see this. But yeah, I, I think they should. They could have used to port over the lightsaber because um, there's a. There's a tag for that. They can actually download and just port it in. This is incredible. I give it. What's the what's the rating? What should I give it? Out of ten. Probably give it nine or, yeah. If if if, if they port over the thing at Stormtrooper, and uh, adding the lightsaber, I give it. I give it a ten. But this honestly, though, like a lot of people, this map has to go viral. A lot of. I just hope a lot of YouTubers talk about this, Halo content creators. Uh, I know that I know a lot of content creators are looking at Forge, Infinite Forge, but uh, I just hope they look, look more at this. Um, looks incredible. So all credit, uh, all credit goes to you guys for putting this over. This is amazing.
but yeah, uh, I'll probably stop the video here. I've uh, been recording for 11 minutes. Uh, but yeah, so if you guys uh, enjoyed this uh, video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe and follow us on Twitch. I do stream Halo there a lot on Twitch. So go ahead and drop a follow and I'll see you Halo fans in the next video. Bye.